Now, <coughs> in two's complement data representation, this is the second one, the last one. What is the procedure? How to write positive numbers? As it is, similarly, I will ask you how to write plus 5 here. How to write plus 5? Hello? Plus 5 can be written as same as in sign magnitude. Same as in one's complement. Here also no change. 0, 1, 0, 1 only. So, whether you take in a one's complement or two's complement data representation, that is for the purpose of negative numbers, not for the positive numbers. Why? Because if you see here, what do you understand? In the case of sine magnitude, plus 5. In the case of one's complement, plus 5. In the case of two's complement, plus 5. All are is in same manner. This is the important conclusion regarding this. Important conclusion. So, positive numbers, whether it is in a sine magnitude or it is in a one's complement, even in the two's complement, the representation is same. No change. The speciality only in the negative numbers. How to get the negative number here? How to get the negative number here? In two's complement representation, how to get it? Whenever if you want to get a negative number in a two's complement representation, first we have to write the positive number. Make a two's complement for that. Earlier what we did? Earlier, one's complement we made to get the negative number. Now what I am telling? We have to make a two's complement because this representation is a two's complement representation. In two's complement representation, the negative numbers are obtained by... First, we have to write the positive number. Make two's complement for that. That becomes as a negative number. So, see here. This is minus 5. Already this is positive number. You made a one's complement for this. Uh, adding one for this, automatically you will get a two's complement. Adding one for this. 1, 1, 0, 1. Which is equal to minus 5. I hope you understand. Sir, in the case of one's complement, two's complement representation, past two numbers does not change. Past two numbers is written as it is, as a sign magnitude. But whereas, to get the negative number, in the case of one's complement, first we write the positive number, make a one's complement for that. Whatever results you got, that is a negative number. Similarly, in the two's complement representation, write the positive number and make the two's complement for that, the negative number can be obtained. Is it clear? Now, how to write zero plus zero? Hello, how to write plus zero? The plus zero can be written as zero, 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 zero. It's okay. Now, minus 0 I have to write. Minus 0, how to write it? First to write the positive number, make two's complement for that. Already you made a one's complement. One, 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 one. One's complement for this one is one, 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 one. Adding one for that, what you are getting? Zero, 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 zero. And one carry you will get. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1 is added means what you will get here? 1 plus 1, 0. 1 plus 1, 0. 1 plus 1, 0. 1 plus 1, 0. And finally you will get a carry. But carry is discarded. In the two's complete repetition, carry is not considered. Carry is discarded. Then what happened here? 0, 0, 0, 0. So, this is the very, 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 very important and highlight point is here. Very, very important and highlight point is here. What is here? What is here? The positive number and negative number are same. The positive number and negative number are same. 
so see in this case what we observed positive and negative number is same so there is no negative zero in the case of two's complement data representation that is the one of the biggest advantage sir how to write plus 12 how to write minus 12 you do yourself i'll tell you the range i will tell you the range the range is very very important the range is very important now how to write the range for this one you check it range range for this one minus 2 power of n minus 1 2 plus 2 power of n minus 1 minus 1 is here sir why 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 because in this case there is no negative 0 negative 0 and positive 0 are same that's why you are getting minus 1 because of the plus 0 this is very 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 important so you write down the notes for this first you write down the notes for this so take down take down take down what do you understand the very popular data representation is true's complement in computer language the data representation is popular is true's complement data representation what is the reason for that because there is no negative zero positive zero only is there negative numbers are possible positive numbers are possible all numbers are possible that's why the two's complement data representation is one of the popular data representation among all the data representations first you take notes here first you take notes uh, one by one once again we will repeat all these four comparisons so coming to the <coughs> first of all One by one, we can talk separately. Right. Unsigned magnitude. What is this? Unsigned magnitude. The other one is signed magnitude. What is that? Signed magnitude. One's complement. One's complement. Two's complement. These are the various signed magnitude. Unsigned magnitude. Unsigned magnitude. Signed magnitude, one's complement, two's complement. In unsigned magnitude, what is the range? 0 to 2 power of n minus 1. 0 to 2 power of n minus 1. What is here? Write yourself. I don't want to write. I'll write, of course, you write. First, you write. Negative numbers are possible. 2 power of n minus 1. Why n minus 1? 1 bit is used for sign. That's why 1 is left. And minus 1. Why this minus 1? Negative 0 is there. 2. Positive numbers. 2 power of n minus 1, minus 1. This is positive numbers. What about here? In one's complement representation, I don't want to write, you don't want to write, you can copy this one. But coming to here, coming to here, minus 2 power of n minus 1, that is negative numbers. 2, positive numbers, 2 power of n minus 1, minus 1. This is example. If you take 8 bits, 
If you take 8 bits, you write down all the examples. What is the range? If you take 8 bits, 0 to, we already discussed 255. Here, 8 bits only I am talking, 8 bits only. Minus 127 to plus 127. Minus 127 to plus 21. When one's complement representation, minus 127 to plus 127. What is here? Minus 128 to plus 127. So, you take the example of some 6 bits. Write down yourself. You take an example of 4 bits. You write down. This is the very very important uh, conclusion on the data representation. What representation? Data representation. So, coming to the, <coughs> I hope you understand. This one, you take this uh, next. What is the main drawback here? What is the main drawback here? Only positive numbers. Only positive numbers. Here, both positive numbers and negative numbers are possible. Both positive numbers and negative numbers are possible. Positive numbers and negative numbers are possible. Only positive numbers. Of course, no negative numbers. Here what happened? There is a negative 0. That is a drawback. There is a negative 0. One weight is, is over. That is a drawback. No negative 0 is here. No negative 0 here. This is the basic differences of different types of data representations. Out of all, the most popular data representation which we are using in computer language systems is two's complement data representation. What is that? Two's complement representation. So, this is what uh, the data representation of different categories. Are you okay?